My name is Maritza Morel. My legacy for HDA throughout all these 10 years is the mentorship and leadership that I have provided, I believe, for the students that I meet and helping them becoming uh, better in their careers. My name is Romero Canto. I'm the chairman and associate professor of pediatric dentistry at Nova Southeastern University in Fort Lauderdale. I think the most rewarding aspect of being a member is, be, is, the, is, the, is the aspect of being a faculty advisor. Uh, every year I said, this is the last year I'm going to do this. And every year I meet a new group of students who are so motivated and committed to, to, to the association that I can't just you know, get away. Hi, my name is Paola Romero. I'm the Director of General Operations for Dr. Roger Campos at Campos Family Dental. I am currently the president of Greater San Antonio Hispanic Dental Association. I am very proud to say I'm a dental hygienist. Now, I want to invite each and every one of you to be part of this organization because this organization consists of all kinds of dental professionals. Hi, my name is Lena O'Brien. I'm a second year student at Columbia University College of Dental Medicine. I came from a background of public health in college, so I knew that 100 million people are uninsured in this country, many of whom are Hispanics, and that Hispanics in particular face a lot of barriers to reaching oral health care. When I came to Columbia, I joined the, uh, the local chapter, and I serve as the dental education outreach. I love meeting other fellow dental students and dentists who share the same mission. We're all going through the same thing. Dental school is difficult, so it's nice to be able to connect and get to know um, your, your classmates, essentially. We may be at different schools, but we're all entering the same profession. My name is Dr. Victor Rodriguez. I'm a general dentist from Houston, Texas, and I'm in solo private practice there. My road started early as a student member of the Hispanic Student Dental Association. We got together to start our first student chapter there. And a few years later, there are great mentorships that we had at the dental school. We started a professional chapter there. We were able to get that energy and use it uh, to all of our benefit in Houston and our Hispanic community there. My name is Courtney Kello, and I am a D2 at Virginia Commonwealth University in Richmond, Virginia. I'm Alyssa Gutierrez. I'm also a D2 at Virginia Commonwealth University. When my dean first approached me about um, this organization and maybe starting a chapter at our school, it really interested me because I'm one of the three Hispanics in my class. So it's definitely something that um, I'm passionate about, not just being Hispanic, but what this organization stands for. I would definitely recommend that people join the HDA. I was a little bit nervous about it at first, also because I'm not Hispanic, I'm actually Greek. So I was a bit concerned that I would sort of be an oddball out at this conference, not being Hispanic, but I've really learned over the past two days that that's really not the central focus of this organization. They've really made it clear to us that it's all about service, education, advocacy, and leadership, and those are four things that anyone can relate to. I became uh, involved as a dental student back in 2000. I was asked, uh, oddly enough, to uh, go ahead and take the student chapter that we had at our school and see what could be done to incorporate uh, folks to get interested about it. And back then, I remember we drummed up about six members. And uh, before we knew it, uh, at one point, we we're the largest chapter in the country. So involvement uh, and enthusiasm uh, can be contagious. The uniqueness of the Hispanic Dental Association is it allows me to help a community that is uh, numerous, yet underserved. Oral health is tied into many systemic issues. Diabetes, cardiovascular disease, in pregnant women it's related to low birth, uh, birth defects. We know now that there's new research coming out with certain types of cancers. The mouth is the gateway to the human body and if it's not healthy and functional, there's a lot of effects not just on the body but also in terms of society. For more information about the Hispanic Dental Association and our upcoming conferences and events, please go to hdasoc.org.